such a big reward offered under you gentlemen that I thought I might just tag along on your next robbery. Might just turn you into the law. Naturally. I'll be in the tavern. The air around here stinks anyway. Just like the food. But the month will go fast. I'm letting you live here. That's so you can tell everybody you've seen what takes place here. <laughs> I didn't hear what the bet was. Your life. famiglia è esclusivamente siciliana. A New York piace così e piace pure a me. La mafia esiste da secoli e resiste perché siamo siciliani, con legami di sangue, vincoli di parentela e matrimoni ben fatti. Sabe jogar? Me desafie. O milionário que moveu as peças para cometer o roubo perfeito. Uma investigadora que está decidida a pô-lo em cheque. E vai me pegar? Espero que sim. E entre eles, um sensual jogo de intrigas e traição, no qual vencerá a mente mais brilhante. O desafio está aberto. Os dois conhecem as regras. E não há lugar para movimentos em falso. Vamos jogar outra coisa. O TCM apresenta um inteligente thriller no qual você não conhecerá até o último minuto quem será o primeiro em virar a mesa. Steve McQueen, Faye Dunaway, Crown, o Magnífico. I was carried away. I wasn't. Celebrate one of the most romantic movies of all time. What would you say if I told you I think I'm in love with you? Love Story. 
You're a preppy millionaire, and I'm smart and poor. If you marry her now, I'll not give you the time of day. Nominated for seven Academy Awards, including Best Picture. Jenny, I'm sorry. Love means never having to say you're sorry. Nothing is real. The Beatles. vont bien s'y retrouver et si l'on garde le désir au moment de choisir de plaquer l'avenir c'est vivre pour vivre Oh, American? Mardo. Stay away from my sister. 
Sister? Wouldn't you see he's one of them? No, I saw only him. When I get through with you, you will be like a fish after skinning. Your best man fights our best man. A secret conclave of the world's top diplomats assembles to select the one man who can save the world from this evil force. And here he is, our man Flint, James Coburn. Even the world's greatest secret agent has to relax once in a while. Let's look at a typical day in Flint's life. His personal barber, fencing for breakfast, karate for lunch, four beautiful babes for dinner, and then a nightcap. That King Cole, Stubby K. Jane Fonda as Cat Baloo, girl train robber. Wow. Okay, you open up. Nope. Now, come on now, open it. <laughs> What's wrong? He won't open safe, says he'd rather die. Is that right, mister? Yeah. Seven left, 26 right, 14 left. <laughs> Come on, jump. Jump, jump. Ten of the Thousand Days. A film on the scale of Beckett, but on a broader emotional canvas. For this is basically a great love story. Richard Burton portrays Henry VIII, a king intrigued with one of the young women in his court, Anne Boleyn. As Anne Boleyn, a remarkable new talent emerges. Her name, Genevieve Bujold. I'm mad for you. I dream of you at night. I long for you by day. I'm no good with any other woman. I think of nothing but you. Of you and me playing dog and bitch. Of you and me playing horse and mare. Of you and me in every way. I want to fill you up. Night after night, I want to fill you up with sons. Bastards. They would be bastards. One word more and I'll strike you. One word more. Without marriage, if you and I have sons, they will be bastards. Patricia Owens, Red Button, Miyoshi Umeki, James Garner, Ricardo Montalban, and many others, including myself, Miko Taka. <laughs> This is the shape of a girl called Fathom. 
You like the layout? Feast your eyes on Fathom. Raquel 39, 22, 33, Welsh. When she slips on her bikini, clips on her grenade earrings, and sets out in search of adventure, <laughs> things really happen. There's only one ship of fools. Starring Vivian Lee as the embittered divorcee of 46 who doesn't want to be 46. I can't settle for things. Bernard Shaw said it, didn't he? If you can't get what you want, you better damn well settle for what you can get. Simone Signore as a mature woman of the world. <laughs> what are you laughing at? My house has been burnt, and they've taken everything I had. Now I'm being taken to prison to an island I know nothing about, and you're giving me a Sunday school sermon. Oscar Werner is the disillusioned ship's doctor. Our biggest mission in life is to avoid being fools. Jose Ferrer in the satiric role of his career. I will not let you talk that way to me. So Lee Marvin as a tough ex-ball player from Texas. Okay, so I bought you a bottle of champagne, right, right. And I know my way around, right? Right. Elizabeth Ashley, the art student, whose standards are strictly her own. 26 days in separate beds. It's probably a very good thing. George Siegel plays the other half of this inconstant love affair. I can't get you out of my system. You're not even really pretty. Thank you. Your head is filled with such garbage. I wish I could just empty it out. Take your hands off me! You even stop it, I'll call for the purser. Jose Greco, world famous dancer. <laughs> Heinz Ruman, and a memorable portrayal of an amiable salesman. Oh, I like people. If you look for it, you can find something good in anybody. Charles Corbin is the cynical captain of the ship. You've seen the kind of characters we get on this ship? I get a cold shudder every time I have to go to the captain's table. Done as a sharp-eyed observer of shipboard life. This is a ship of fools. I'm a fool. You'll meet more fools as we go along. This tub is packed with them. Based on the best-selling novel and brought to the screen by Stanley Kramer. There are many stories here, but there is only one ship of fools. Get yourselves guns and wipe them off the face of the earth. It's the end of the world. Thus saith the Lord God unto the mountains, the hills, and the rivers, and the valleys. Behold, I, even I, shall bring a sword upon you, and I will devastate your high places. Doesn't it seem odd that they wait all that time to start a, a war against humanity? What do you think they were after? I think they were after the children. For what purpose? To kill them. The things were getting interesting again. Bond, 007, licensed to kill whom he pleases, where he pleases, 
when he pleases. The Night of the Generals adds yet another major motion picture to producer Sam Spiegel's long list of award-winning successes. Peter O'Toole as General Tance, the perfect soldier, a fanatic molded of steel and ice. Omar Sharif as Major Grau, the perfect hunter. Finding a killer became an obsession, and even death could not deter him. Just what do you think you're doing? My job. Tom Courtney, Joanna Pettit, seeking together an island of love amidst a sea of savage destruction. What's the matter? You know, we mustn't like each other too much. Why? It's because... Because I'm a corporal and you're a general's daughter. It's a man, a girl, a war. Calibac! Donald Pleasance as one of the generals who had something to conceal. And as a French police inspector in occupied Paris, Philippe Noiret. Here are the names of three generals. I want to know everything about them. Everything might be too much. One of them is... Uh, a murderer. Only one. But murder is the occupation of generals. L'amour est plus jeune que la mort, même s'ils ont vu le jour en même temps. And Christopher Plummer as Field Marshal Rommel. From the pages of the world acclaimed bestseller. There was no quiet on the Western Front. The time is 1916, when a new breed was born, a new kind of hero, the Air Ace. Here are the heroes, the cowards, the daredevils, blazing across the skies. Grabbing for glory four miles up above the thunder of no man's land. The Blue Max, a film big enough to encompass a world war. Yet intimate enough to share the dreams, emotions, and personal conflicts of men in battle. you hear because we've had to. I wonder if you're as good as you think you are. In or out of bed. Starring George Pippard as Lieutenant Bruno Stockholm. Brilliant, brutal, ruthless. His great obsession, the Blue Max, an ounce of metal and silver. But for this man, it was proof that he was equal to all men and greater than most. I'll see you never wear that medal. You disobeyed my orders. I'm going to have you court martialed. James Mason as the general who thought he could use and control him. And Ursula Andress as the general's beautiful wife. Time magazine calls him one of the most cunning, evil characters of modern fiction. From the bold and breathless international bestseller, The Collector, comes the suspenseful, disturbing drama of a strange progression. From thought to wish. From desire to obsession. From dream to nightmare. How long are you going to keep me here? I don't know. It depends. On what? On my falling in love with you? Because if that's 
what you want. I'm going to be here until I die. Terence Stamp creates a remarkable portrait of the hero villain. Tender. Brutal. Tormented. Dangerous. You are about to share every fantastic step of the most daring mass escape ever conceived in the mind of man. Only a madman could plan it. What the hell is this? Only desperate men fighting for their lives could follow it. Only a hijacked prison train could blast them on their frenzied dash to freedom. From the great bestseller comes this story of an incredible American pilot down behind enemy lines in Italy. Ryan Joseph L., Colonel United States Army Air Corps, 0718359. Don't you salute senior officers in your army, Major? See this creature with her curved stone English that'll keep her in the gutter till the end of her days? Ew, what's that you say? <laughs> in six months, I'll make a duchess of this draggle-tailed gutter snipe. You expect me to get into that? How do you do? How do you do? So you came here to rescue her from worse than death, eh? Cheerio, Eliza. The rain in Spain stays mainly in the plain. I think she's got it. I could have danced all night. an order. You make me sick with your heroics. There's a stench of death about you. You carry it in your pack like the plague. You and that Colonel Nicholson, you're two of a kind. Crazy with courage. For what? How to die like a gentleman. How to die by the rules. When the only important thing is how to live like a human being. My name is Nicholson. Give me the book. Well, by all means. You read English, I take it. Do you read the Japanese? I'm sorry, no, but if it's a matter of precise translation, I'm sure that can be arranged. You see, the code specifically states that the... Take everybody along. 
Every seat is first class, and we've got enough seats for everybody. This is the way to travel. It is a wonderful world if you'll take the time to go around it. Michael Thomas, Around the World in 80 Days.